saying some Red Dead Redemption, and yeah. Um, I actually, I um, I did a mission without um without recording, and because just because I, I, just, yeah, without playing with my dad. So yeah, I'm going to um do this mission. But my horse is out of whistling range. So I need to go close enough to them. Sorry, I'm just um, charging my charging headset. Now I can run. Nope. What about that one? What about that one? No. Morgan. Are those a group of Morgans? Is this a group of Morgans? Which what is that? Good. 
I broke the horse. Oh man, bounty hunters! This is. Let's go to this mission. John? Let's get on. Good. And you? Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See you, Arthur. Ain't that dumb. <laughs> Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. <sighs> Hello. Hi, Reverend. Uh, who did you call a goddamn drunkard? So <laughs> I got no idea. Hello, Mr. Morgan. Hi, Arthur. Come here a minute. What is it? <sighs> Can I ask you a favor? Probably not. Very funny. Would you do something with Jack? He seems kind of down. All this upheaval can't have been easy on the poor kid. <sighs> Why? Because I'm your preferred nursemaid because he likes you and well you know his father's useless okay thank you oh jack hello reverend heard that on youtube i know that i don't know who jack is i think yeah i know him i know that wait what the he just fell on the ground. He did it again. What the? <laughs> wow, that's so weird. So weird. Hey there. Hi there. What the? <laughs> what if I go there? Will I fall too? Can I walk over her? How are you? Okay, let's go. There it is. Yeah, that is. I know who that is. Yeah, see on YouTube. What you up to? Playing. Anything fun? I guess. You want to come fishing with me? Fishing? Sure. You're right. It's about time that you started to earn your keep. Okay. Good. Let's go get your pole then. Now, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? I sure do. Uncle Jose made me one. Good. Well, let's go get it then. Go catch us some fish. <laughs> yeah. All 
I'll mount up and lift you on when you're ready. Hold on. I think I wanna. Never mind. Let's go then, Uncle Arthur. So, where are we going? Just down to the river near here. We shouldn't go too far from camp. Oh, okay. You feeling better? I know you was a little sick. Oh, I'm fine. You're a brave kid. So, just like you. Well, I don't know about brave. I ain't much of a kid no more. Though your mama might disagree. There are a few other women, I guess. What do you mean? Just talking silly. It's been a tough few weeks up in that snow. I like the snow. Yes, but not like that. When are we going back to the other camp? The one near Blackwater? Yeah. Well, we're not. This is our spot. For now, anyway. Why? I forgot a storybook there. We left so quick. Oh, I'm sure someone can get you another storybook. Really? When? Well, <laughs> we'll see. Max bonding level. You've unlocked the ability to drift with this horse. Hold square and press. Um. Now fish to catch. Ooh! All right. I wanna go on a drift. Where should we stand, Uncle Arthur? No, no I want to go sure. back on the horse. Come on, follow me. Mm. I want to check to to check out the the drift. Just huh? the water there? You mean? Tap on a hold. Tap. Then. Where's your pole, Uncle Arthur? First, we need some bait. Oh, yeah. I'm... Ooh, another Hot Wheel. I'm going to use some cheese. Cheese? Bellier the better. Now, cast your line. Swing the rod back over your shoulder. And bring it forward in a smooth motion. Use your wrist, not your elbow. How do I know? Like that? That's it. Good. All we do now, Jack, is wait for a fish to take the bait. How do I know when I've got a bite? Well, if you feel the tip of your fishing rod just twitching, don't yank it yet. That just means one's nibbling. You feel a hard tug. That's a fish going for the bait, so yeah. Oh. Something's the... tugging at your rod, Uncle Arthur. Got one, Jack. Is it a big one? You see him fighting there, Jack? That's when you gotta be careful. You, you'll break the line. Best to wear him out first before you try to reel him in. Now, well, seems like he's taking a rest now. I'm gonna try reeling him in nice and steady. Look, Jack, it's a small mouth bass. It's almost as small as you. We should really throw these smaller ones back. Give him a chance to grow up a bit. Nah. Ooh, we got 20 bucks. Can I take a break right. from fishing? I want to make something. Okay. I'm going to pick some of those red flowers. I'll be right back. Ooh. 
you got a stick at things, Jack. Whoop, think I got one. Yay. Bro, that one's so little. Oh, this one's a red fin pickerel. Not bad. Okay, I'm gonna just get this one. Now I'm done fishing. Fishing sure is boring, Uncle Arthur. Yeah, I know. Boring as hell. But then... Something happened. And you can get food for days. Really? If you're lucky. But until then, you just sit and wait. And try not to worry. It's good for you. It's good for you? I guess. Huh. What are you making there? You'll see. It's a surprise. I think you've got a bite. Look. There we go. Pull him in. You still all right over there? I'm fine. Just want to catch one more. Then we'll call it a day. Same one. Hey, look at this. And what? This necklace I made. Necklace? For Mama. Sure. What a fine young man. And in such complex circumstances. Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? Who are you? Yes, Arthur Morgan. Vanderlyn's most trusted associate. You've read the files. Typical case. Orphan street kid seduced by that maniac silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Agent Milton? Agent Ross. Pinkerton Detective Agency, seconded to the United States government. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. Five thousand dollars for your head alone. Five thousand dollars? For me? Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's it. Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Oh, ain't that a little old-fashioned nowadays? Apparently not. Listen, this is my offer, Mr. Morgan. Bring in Vanderlyn, and you have my word you won't swing. Oh, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent uh, Milton. You see, I haven't done anything wrong, aside from not play the games to your rules. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. Mac Callender? He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. So really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow, but merciful. <laughs> you enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. I enjoy society, flaws and all. You people venerate huh. savagery, and you will die. Savagely, all of you. Oh, we're all gonna die, Agent. Some of us, sooner than others. Good day, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Enjoy your fishing, kid. While you still can. <laughs> Who are they? No one to worry about. No one at all. Come on. Let's pick up your things and get home. Oh. It's getting late, Jack. Your mother would be worried. Let's head back. We haven't even been here for that long.
idiot. Why did you lie about where Uncle Dutch is? Because, well, because those are disagreeable men, and I don't want them to hurt him. What did they mean about Mac? Is he in jail? Uh, no, I don't uh, think so. I hope he's just fine where he is. Like I said, don't worry about them. The world is full of disagreeable men. That's why you got all of us to protect you. Folk like them. Now, how about that necklace you made? You still got it, right? Yeah, I got it. Good. Well, did you like fishing? It was okay, I think. It's a lot of waiting around. It is. <laughs> yeah. Got to do the drift. Great. We caught a fish and I made you this necklace. Ain't that pretty? Ain't I the luckiest? Did you thank Uncle Arthur? No need. We had a good time. What's wrong? Nothing. Just met some folk. I better go speak with Dutch. Okay. Hey. You did real fine, kid. Thanks. <sighs> we got a problem. What? I just met some guys out near the river. A fella named, um, Milton and, uh, I don't remember the other fella's name. Ross. Milton and Ross. And? and they are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they know about the train and they know we're here. Were you followed back here? No. They know we're near here. And they want you, Dutch. They offered me my freedom in exchange, they did. Why didn't you take it? <laughs> Very funny. Well, what do we do now? I say we do nothing just yet. It's just trying to scare us into doing something stupid. We have turned a corner. We survived them mountains. We just need to stay calm. Let's save. The Fisher of Men. Yeah. I'm in this video now. Bye.